Businesses and consumers, and especially gamers these days, are desperate to boost their computer performance. The problem, though, heat slows everything down, and it can even, in some cases, make your computer crash. But now there's a liquid cooling system that keeps your processors super cool and super fast. And in addition, it'll also keep your desktop beverage chill. Joining us now is Jeff Lyon. He's CEO of Cool It Systems. Welcome. Pleasure to have you here. Thanks for having me. And I love this story because out of this particular device, which we're going to talk about in just a second, came this particular device, almost accidentally, and it's it's selling like hotcakes. So it absolutely is. Let's start with this. This this device cools your computer, and you've targeted a to begin with anyway a specific audience, the gamers. Why? Well, the whole reason that uh, we chose the gamers to start with is number one, they have a, an insatiable appetite for performance. Mm -hmm. um, they cannot get enough of an unfair advantage when they're online fighting it out and. Uh, enjoying their online experience. The, uh, um, the primary benefit that we're delivering to them is not only speed and reliability, but it's also the uh, reduced noise. Okay, so it reduces noise on top of that, which I'm sure everybody else in the household appreciates. And this works by putting, basically, tell us how it works. There's a, there's a liquid here, and I'm making it move. You can kind of see that bubble as it moves through the mm -hmm. tube. So specifically, what does this all do? Well, what the, uh, the liquid does is much like um, any other liquid cooling solution like in your car or something like that, it uh -huh. actually recirculates that liquid and this little silver block here mounts right directly onto the CPU to gather the heat that the CPU is creating. Mm -hmm. And then we go into the other unit over here, which is uh, something cube. we call a, a chiller. And we've harnessed the power of something called thermoelectrics. Um, thermoelectrics are like solid state heat pumps. They're like the, the little white wafers that we see inside here. You put electricity through them, there's a hot side and a cold side. So we actually refrigerate the liquid and then recirculate that cold liquid down across the CPU to really reduce the temperature dramatically. And how much does this unit cost? Uh, that unit right there is the eliminator. It'll cost $199. And you've recently added a new retail partner, and that's Dell? Uh, well, actually, Dell has uh, put our technology inside one of their most recent... So it's uh, not an add-on. They've included it in the construction of the computer. That's exactly right. Well, that certainly helps business. Yeah, it sure does. Now, as a result of this innovation, when they were putting things together, uh, this came out, which is a beverage chiller, and it has a little UBS uh, port attachment. And basically, it uses the same technology, it's just for a different application. It sure does. It, it basically started out as a joke. We uh, were kind of goofing around at the office and saying that it'd be, uh, it's a shame we don't chill beer because we'd probably make more money. And, and <laughs> <laughs> as it happens, uh, you know, the joke took one step further when uh, our CTO, Sandy, uh, came back in the room the next day and plugged in the, uh, the USB beverage chiller. Um, and the, the plate got cold immediately, and we thought, well, you know what, why not? And so did the brew. Yeah, absolutely. And what's the retail price about for something like this? Uh, it retails somewhere between uh, twenty dollars and twenty-four dollars, depending well, I'll, on the retailer. I'll tell you, I had to put it in my desk drawer because everybody who walked past my desk s wanted one. So you got a winner on that, which it, is why you're in our innovation segment. <laughs> I appreciate that, Mr. Lyon. Thank you very much. Best of luck. My pleasure. A quick break, and then up next, if there's an auto show anywhere in the world.